The House of Representatives has as well achieved that the Federal Competition and Consumer Protection Commission, FCCPC, for its inability to protect the rights of Nigerians over the recent hike in price of cement. The Joint Committee of Solid Minerals, Industry, Commerce and Special Duties expressed a displeasure today in Abuja when the agency appeared before it during a public hearing of the committee to investigate the arbitrary increase in the price of cement by manufacturers of cement in Nigeria. The chairman of the committee, Honorable Jonathan Gaza, while describing FCCPC as a mother that has forgotten her child, said the increase in price of cement has a direct bearing with the increase of building collapses experienced in the country. We likened, I don't mean to sound hard, but to a mother that has forgotten her children. It's because if anybody, at about the time that we're having hike in cement prices, what FCCP came out on the news for was closing Sahad for different prices of planting. Earlier, the Director of Surveillance and Investigations, FCCPC, uh, Adeinka, and the Chairman of Council for the Regulation of Engineering in Nigeria, Engineer Sadiq Abubakar, said increase in price of cement is not as a result of dollar increase, but an epileptic power supply, high cost of diesel, and operational cost. Major raw materials are locally, you know, um, annexed and sourced for. So the fluctuation in dollar was not an issue. And that was why we were very curious to discover that the price seemed to have been jumping with the market prices, uh, with the um, rising cost of um, dollar. Also speaking, the head of Building Research Nigeria, Building and Road Research Institute, Jibril Sule, said the institute has introduced postulant as an alternative to cement as a step to manage the high cost of the product. The Nigerian Building and Road Research have gone to an extent that we produce what we call postulana. This postulana is what actually the Nibri produce. We produce it using clay. And this percentage we have to use clay and pancanel to produce a pozzolana. This pozzolana will help you, instead of using the cement 100%, it gives you a room where at least a certain percentage of the cement, because if the pozzolana we are talking about, we cannot use ordinarily as a cement. The DBT controller, Tarif Trade, Mrs. Nwagan of the Niger Customs Service informed the committee that it has no records of limestone exportation. We don't have records of exportation of limestone. We don't. Okay. Fantastic. So everything produced Sorry. is consumed in house. Sorry. Yes. They, they, the the, the, the yes. cement manufacturers of Nigeria yes. have to import to augment what they source locally. What, what we even have locally is not enough, so they have to even import more to augment what they have, what they can source locally. 